Good morning, Kingdom Saints, and welcome. Welcome. I just want to say to everybody, start your day off with Jesus. You know what I'm saying? You need to start your day off with Jesus. Have Jesus stayed on your mind. He's going to get you through the day. He's going to get you through everything you're going through. He's going to get you through everything, everything in this world, you know what I'm saying? Because this world right now is going down, down hill. It's going downhill. So we really, we really need to place an emphasis on staying strong in our faith because the scripture says that Scripture says that many will be swayed, you know what I'm saying? Even it says uh, even the elect shall befall. I mean shall fall away. Even the elect. Because you know, when that time comes, they're gonna wanna eat, they're gonna wanna buy, they're gonna wanna sell, they don't wanna be martyred, they don't wanna be persecuted, they don't wanna be set apart. But see what the world doesn't realize is when you're set apart when you're set apart, you're saved from everything in this world and you have eternal why you think and you have eternal life. Why you think we're so happy? We don't fear death because death is nothing. Oh dead, where is thy sting? Jesus said, remember this. Jesus said, I have overcome death, and so shall you. So you know, just start your day off knowing that you have an eternal resting place with Christ Jesus in the heavenly nation. Amen? And don't let nothing get on you. Don't let nothing bring you down and don't let nobody take your mind away from Jesus. Don't let nobody change your character of who you are and who you are in Christ. Okay? So, don't let nothing get you down. And you're just Brush it off and count it all as joy. Amen. Because when they see that light of Jesus shining in you, they're going to say to themselves, he or she is truly a man of God. Just like that soldier, that centurion said on Jesus' last day. And he saw everything that was going on at the time and the hour of his death. He said, truly, this, this man was the son of God. He became a believer. Amen? But don't wait until you have to see to believe because the Lord said, Blessed are those who have not seen yet believed, for they shall inherit the kingdom of heaven. Am I right about it? Okay, so um, don't forget to subscribe there, 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 boy. And thanks for watching. Open your Bible today. Open your Bible and pray. Open your Bible today. Open your Bible and pray. Open it.